want you to close your eyes and go back to the day that the event happened. Please indicate yes or no answers by grunting once for yes and twice for no. And do you understand? Hmm. So David, you are in the dark room and in your hands you are holding your, <clears throat> excuse me, your stuffy. I want you to open your eyes now, David. I know you are scared, but I need you to do this for the therapy to work properly. Can you do that for me? <clears throat> David, this is only a simple little memory game. Nothing can hurt you or anyone else during this exercise. I assure you, there's nothing to fear. Now, can you please open your eyes? <clears throat> David, nothing can hurt you. I promise you are safe. Okay, so on the count of three, you are going to open your eyes, yes? Mm. Very good. Here we go. One. Two. Three. to you, David. Remember, they'll take me away from you. You don't want them to take me away from you, right? <laughs> What's that, David? What do you mean, no? Shh, don't tell me, David. They'll take me. Mm. Good, David. Very good. You are doing great. We are making wonderful progress today. He wants to hurt me, David. You have to stop him. I know you hear me, David. You know I'm right. He wants to hurt me. Just like your father hurt your mother. And just like you hurt your father for hurting her. You won't let him hurt me, right? Now this is important, David. I need you to set your stuffy aside. Doesn't matter where you set him down. Somewhere, anywhere, time to cut the cord. You see, David, just like I told you, he wants to separate us so he can hurt me. You can't let him hurt me. You promised you'd always protect me just like I always protect you. for the best. I know. He was taking over. What he said makes sense. No. He needed to be silenced. That's why I trapped him.
What if I don't want him to be silenced? Gary! No! Once. You owe me for ditching me. <laughs> Mila, I'm not ditching you. You know, I don't believe in that stuff. I just, I can't do it. It's not working out. It'll be so quick. You wouldn't even know what happened. There you go. Fine, make it quick. Your new foster parents will be here soon. Seven of Swords, the Fool, and Judgment. What is that supposed to mean? Betrayal, new beginnings, and clarity. That doesn't make any sense. Okay, you know what? Where are your new parents? They're late. It makes sense. It means I won't let anyone betray me anymore. What? <laughs> My night came. Save me.
So, you're, you're here? Are, are you really here? You, you haven't aged. It's been years. You, but, but aren't you dead? I'm afraid so, sis. Serena, I'm here because I've seen you suffering. I've seen you with all of your guilt. And I need you to know that it wasn't your fault for me dying. But why now? Why not when I did that seance or when I used that stupid spirit board? I had to find my voice first. I finally found it, so here I am. And I found something else too. Where did you find that? I, I buried that in the dirt. That stupid spell didn't even work. Sis, that guy was not the knight in shining armor you wanted. Figured that one out too late. Instead of a knight in shining armor, I got a peasant who just knew how to make it. But we always dreamed of having a double wedding and that dream turned into nightmares. I'm sorry, sis. I wish we could go back, but you can only go forward until it's your time. Oh, but then just wait till you see all the things I can show you. Can I give you a piece of advice? Of course. Be your own knight. But you never told me what happened. again, Sam. Excuse me. What, what are you talking about? Where am I? Who the hell are you? <laughs> What's the matter? Memory problems? Did you hit your head on something? I... Uh, wait. You did this to me? Azrael? What have you got to say for yourself, wizard? Hey, shh. You hear that? That sound of silence? Enjoy it while it lasts. <laughs> what the hell is that supposed to mean? Well, look at the time. I'll have to get going, but thanks for playing. And good luck finding me without your special little scrying stone. <laughs> what? No. <laughs> the stone is mine at last. Goodbye, Samuel, and good luck in your new world. I have a feeling you're gonna need it. They have been waiting for you, and they are hungry! What? No! 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 no!
I summon Karnas, the spirit of chaos! <laughs> Karnoth, why have you summoned me? Great Karnoth, I suffer the peace of my time in pain silence. Then let the hills run with blood. Yes, yes, let the glory of battle be upon us. Also, who's going to cover my expenses? Uh, I, uh, uh, uh. On this twenty-five dollar gift card. Uh, uh, I got uh, four dollars twenty. Four twenty. Right. No, no, no. This will cover an hour, an hour and a half tops. All right. Fair enough. Okay, let's go. All right. Chaos, 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 chaos. for his body here. What does it matter? When I saw the ball in our garage. I knew what you'd done. It's a prom night I'll never forget. His mother recognized the fibers from your dress. They never found the dress. She made it complicated. Killing his parents, too? It was too much. Was it? I couldn't let you get away with it. I know, Dad. That's why I had to silence you, too. Come on, Samantha. You can't just ignore me forever. Sam, watch out! What is wrong with you? Pull over! Damn it, Samantha! When are you gonna stop behaving like this? Seems like you just hate me all the time now. Do you want to get a divorce? Haha, <laughs> really funny. We don't need games. We're trying to have a conversation here. I think you're right, Roger. Uh, about what? I want a divorce. <laughs> Somebody's clearly messing with us. We should talk about this later. You're upset, I'm upset. I'm sorry I even brought it up. Do you recognize this dress, Roger? This is my prom dress. But how is it here? <laughs> I don't know who is doing this, but I've had enough. It's ridiculous. Leave us alone. Daddy, I want to play ball. This is funny. We don't even have kids. Sam? You would have been. I got pregnant on prom night, and I never told you. We got in a fight, and then there was the car accident, and I lost the baby. 
I wasn't sure if I was ready to be a mother. And then after the accident, I couldn't be. And I just never had the heart to tell you. Mommy, can we play, please? Dana, you scared me. I thought you were in Portland today. Something called me back. <laughs> well, don't sneak up on people like that. Sheesh. I love coming here. It's such a nice view. Feeling the wind on my face. The sound of the birds. It's silent. I found this bird in the forest. Or it found you. What? You were chosen, Asha. What, what are you? <laughs> You've lost your hearing, but your self-pity will lose you your life. I'm here to stop that from happening. I'll be your protector, your fairy goth mother. You have a special destiny, Jane. You can't hear what others say anymore, but you can hear all the things that others can't. You aren't broken. You're fixed. Time to set sail, Jane. It's time to start your journey. you to go away. You asked for my help. Now, I'm here. 
I didn't ask for help. Really? You don't remember what they did to you? <gasps> no, please! They beat you, stole from you, cheated you. There's only one way I'll be silent again. You must end them. <laughs> but you can't do it alone. <laughs> Together. Little guy, <gasps> Don, look. <laughs> 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 <laughs>